What's up, I'm travel photographer Brendan Vanton of brendansadventures.com and I'm here hard at work in the Florida Keys. So we made it to the Florida Keys and I am so stoked about it. This was one of the big goals on our US road trip was to make it to the Florida Keys. We've come already like 10,000 kilometers from where we left in Canada and now we're like 100 kilometers by sea to Cuba. It's unreal to think how much land we've traveled and it is so nice to be here. I'm not wearing a jacket, I'm not wearing full on trousers. I've got my shorts on, I got my t-shirt on. It's nice and warm and I feel good about this. I feel great about this. This is so cool and a really fantastic location. Here in the winter months in the United States, it sure beats the snow back home. Anyways, we're in a place called Bahia Honda State Park and it's a really cool location. You've got beaches and things like that back there, but from a photography standpoint, I'm gonna be focusing on that old bridge down there. That's an old railroad bridge. It's all broken up and it makes a good background. I've also got some rocks and water rushing over the rocks over here, which will make up the foreground of my images. And yeah, I'm excited to be in the Keys as you can probably tell, so let's get shooting. So one of the things I wanted to photograph down here in the Florida Keys was the obvious side of things down here, and that's the tropical side of things. I wanted to photograph the beach, I wanted to photograph some of these palm trees, and I wanted to photograph some of these jetties. I always tend to look for places where I can kind of make water melt and make it smooth, and so now I'm just basically gonna relax in the sand and wait for the sun to go down, and then I'm gonna shoot some scenes out here, somewhere along here. It's absolutely beautiful here, it's about, uh, 28 degrees Celsius or something like that right now. A little bit of a sea breeze to keep things cool. Absolutely perfect. Let's go take some photos. So sadly, we're about to leave the Lower Keys, and it's been a really good time. It's been really fun shooting these coastal scenes around here in Key West, Sugarloaf Key. It's actually been a lot of fun camping too. Um, the good news is, we're heading north now and we're going up to the Everglades. So this episode is gonna continue. We're heading up to Homestead tonight and then into the Everglades tomorrow. Let's hit it. So we made it to Everglades National Park and we're gonna go cruising around this morning looking for some cool stuff to see. We're at a spot called Royal Palm, which is where I'm told is the best opportunity to see some wild gators and that's what I really wanna see. So let's get in there and see if we can find some. So this just in, the Everglades are f***ing awesome. To be honest, we were planning just like a little quick morning trip into the Everglades to see if we could see some gators or some birds or something like that. And now we've decided to spend the entire day here because it really is out of this world cool. It's uh, probably a little bit on the touristy side, but there's lots of places to escape. We're in an area called Pinelands here, as you can see around me. And it is, as I mentioned, pretty f***ing cool.
So that's it from the show here in Southern Florida. We've done the Florida Keys, we've done the Everglades, and it's been absolutely unreal. It's been such a good time because I'm out in shorts and t-shirt and that's the way I'm meant to be. No more winters for me ever. I'm done with that stuff. Anyways, the U.S. road trip continues now. We still got like a month left in the southern United States. We're zipping all the way across the country. We're going to hit up some cool spots in Utah, like Zion, like Arches National Park, like Page, um, and then all the way over to San Francisco, and it should be really awesome. So be sure to subscribe to the channel and stay tuned. There's lots of really cool travel photography still to come. I'll catch you next time. Peace.